M. D. Snyder from Twisted Sister, Strangeland, House of Hair, soon to be growing up twisted by God, I'm everywhere! And you're watching InfernalDreams.net. Yeah. All right, ladies and gentlemen, this is Ryan Buckley coming to you live from Full Moon Convention in Nashville, Tennessee, 2010. You know who this is. This is Dee Snyder from Twisted Sister. And uh, Dee, what do you think about the con so far? Um, it's uh, relaxing so far. Um, very relaxing. Good vibe, good atmosphere. And uh, I know a lot of these people from, you know, from the business doing my radio show. So it's like, like old friends, Bill Mosley, Ken Forey, Doug, David Rashawn. The crew, so we will hear Scott Compton Taylor. So absolutely, it's nice to see everybody. So it's like having everybody back home again. Yeah, right? yeah, it's like camp for you guys. Yeah, awesome. So uh, how's the radio show going? Uh, well, I do a national radio show called House of Hair. Mm -hmm. It's in its thirteenth year, two hundred and twenty-something stations in North America, and now we're all overseas. So that's going great. So uh, that's great. Fangoria Radio, not so much. Fangoria Radio is sort of on its last legs. Uh, it was so unfortunately did it for a few years, but. Well, I mean, these things happen. Yeah, 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 but there's so many other things going on. I start a Monday, I start shooting a reality show for Amy. Oh, excellent. With my family called Growing Up Twisted. Oh, wow. And that'll be airing this summer. So watch for that. Excellent. In June, I start shooting Strangeland Disciple, the sequel, uh, hopefully long awaited for some people. Oh, absolutely. To, uh, to Strangeland, we start filming. So you can look for that, I think, uh, first quarter of 2011. Uh, sounds about right. And that's exciting because we've got. Um, Robert England back. Uh, we got uh, Robert Kurtz from the Can B doing special effects. We got um, Dave Porker who directed The Hills Run Red, uh, directing the movie. So it's going to really come together. So we, and Debbie Rashawn's got a little part in it. Ah, oh, excellent. Well, we got an interview with her later, did really. So, um, like with with the strength slam and everything, um, did you have any difficulty? Like the sequel's been coming in the waiting in the wings oh, essentially for years and years yes. and years. Did you have difficulty, like, with the studio? Or, like, I heard that there was some conflict going on. Oh, yeah. Well, I, I felt, I, just, I started to feel like the Boy Who Cried sequel after a while, you know? Uh, but what happened was, it's a little complicated. Remember the Enron deal? Remember Enron? I think there's something, yeah, okay. it a bell. Yeah, okay. Well, basically, an Enron-type uh, scandal happened with the company that made the first one, yeah. the shooting gallery. And uh, uh, the CFO cooked the books. Uh, this is the company that made... Uh, Sling Blade, You Can Count on Me, right. Coupier, all Category Award nominated movies. CFO cooked the books, he was arrested, government seized all the property along with my rights to my movie. So for eight years I was in the courts fighting to get my paid rights back. And did all that government red tape. Yeah, so I spent a lot of money just to get the rights to make the movie, a new movie, basically. So I finally got them a couple years ago. And now we're finally getting back up and running. So oh, excellent. Uh, the sequel was great. Right after the first one came out, but then this whole big deal with the government. And uh, so anyway, finally it's happening. What do you know? It's the man trying to get us all down again. Yeah, it's the man. Absolutely. The man. So uh, in terms of music, do you have any projects that are coming out anytime soon in your future that uh, we'll talk about maybe? Uh, Twisted Sister is really a, a hobby for me now. Right. Every year we do... Uh, we do some Christmas shows, we do some festivals, we get ready to gear up to do some festivals all over the world this summer. Uh, it's fun, but it's not really like a musical uh, thing. Uh, the most interesting thing, and this isn't official, it's unofficial, but I'll tell you. Yeah. All right, awesome. I'm going be blessing. But uh, Alice Cooper and I have, have been uh, working on an a, a idea for a duet's record. I think you just made my boss's day and mine too. Yeah. Because so we, I can't tell you that there's, a, there's a, sort of a fee behind it. We, we did our first demo, and it came out so amazing because, I mean, I'm, a, I'm an Alice Cooper disciple. Right. So, Al, but Alice is like low, low range and I'm high range. So together, it's like, we work great. So we did a, we did a, a, a test track, came out really good. So right now, we're uh, looking to, to move forward on, on a duet's record. That's um, unofficial. Well, still, that's big. Yeah. Big news, yes. and with everything that's going on, it sounds like you're going to have a busy year coming up. Yeah, man, I mean, it, it just goes way beyond that. I mean, there's so much going on. I'm a national spokesperson for the Washington Times Backers for Babies. So I travel around uh, doing work with that. And, uh, you know, I've just I've got a lot of I can't, people are talking about writing, writing my memoirs, a book deal coming, so many other uh, projects. And uh, it's very busy. As a matter of fact, I gotta go. <laughs> no, 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 I can always say, I always have a minute for you, and you, and you.
Is it what am I talking to? <laughs> the kids out there watching Everybody. the dreams. Of course. Yes. We got fans, right? Maybe. Absolutely. One or two. It doesn't matter. But anyway, D, thank you so much for all your time and everything. And uh, do you have a website or anything out there that you want to plug for the cats and kids? Sure, yeah. Go to uh, dsnyder.com and it's Snyder with an I. Remember, my last name is an adjective, not a proper noun. <laughs> I'm Snyder than you are. Damn right. All right, thank you again, sir. Pleasure, man. You take it easy. All right, take it easy.